But I love la making live videos. It's yeah. exciting, and I'm young. Yeah. No, everybody, uh, cheers, Bunna uh, Yazachu. Hi, 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 salam. Tamarshi uh, Mirchalo. Yeah, we're cake in the mouth now. Tanisha Dadaru Gariara Renastal, of course. Like, it's a little bit burnt. Oh, right? I like the crispy things. It's nice. Yeah, but Pira thinks it's perfect because he likes it it's very crispy. It's the best part, nearly. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we will taste it and, yeah, please join us. And I like, um, Damutana Gagrana Ladala. Shai Manambu Nezachin Damut Kamatuna Damtabuki. Yeah. So in the third we will protect it protected. Yeah. So if we can just take it up. Yeah, it's not need to clean it up. Yeah, no. exactly. Yeah. And then like this one? Yeah. Wow. It smells good. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Here in Denmark, we like always like cake. They eat it when it's warm. Yeah. Or we can start with this like triangle. <laughs> Do you say in your country you often put it uh, first eat it when it's cold? Yeah, we we our cakes normally they are uh, they are cream cake. Yeah. Oh yeah. Instead of like this, but yeah, normally we eat it cold and with cream. Yeah. It's like caramel. Yeah, yeah, yeah the sugar. That's great. Thanks a lot. Mm. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I love it when it's warm. It's good. <laughs> so it's like this. Uh, I would like to post it on a, on, you know, on YouTube if somebody makes it. Okay. Oh, I try to make also okay. this cake. Yeah, yeah? That's nice. So um, wonderful. Yeah. You can't come. You can't. Yeah, yeah, well, that's true. You can't comment. So, it's good, guys. So, gaba gaba. So, thanks. Was nice. Good. Nah, yeah, share it now. We're going to talk. We're going to talk about it. So the mama. Talk. Mm. Oh, it taste. Perfect. Is it perfect? Yes. Excellent. Hmm? No, but cafe nowhere. <laughs> anyway. It's funny. It's funny to see now. I know in your country you normally eat eat with your fingers. Yeah. But see here, <laughs> I take it with my hand. That's yeah, funny. You don't now it's you that use me. use a teaspoon. Yeah. Are, are you doing it for that guys? No. For those guys? I like Maybe to. it's because we're an Ethiopian culture and in video. Maybe different if there was some cream yeah. on top of it. Yeah, but normally if it's small cake, you just a lot of people pick it up. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, sometimes I, I pick robo, marble, mm -hmm. but uh, yeah, this is also easy. I remember my mom always said, everything that can fly is allowed to eat with the fingers. <laughs> so I'm sorry for simply it's not possible to eat pigs yeah. and cow, they and cannot fly. Yeah, <laughs> so you can eat chicken. Chicken and, and birds, birds and whatever, yeah. Dogs. Yeah, dogs. 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 Uh, yeah, yeah. Quack, quack. yeah, duck, yeah. Yeah. So, mm, mm. Yeah, so good. there's five people. It's good enough. Like we get used to. Well, we do in the other groups. We get used to like 400 people and something. Okay. Right. Yeah. We go like, but anyway. But no, it's five people. It doesn't matter. It's you nice know, to get I, I respect each and everyone. Yeah. Yeah. But you can comment any question you have. Um, so now we're going to talk about a case. Okay. Yeah. And it's about a mom and a daughter. A mom and a daughter? Yeah. So. Okay. 
No, it's about a family. You can say it's about a family. You don't need to take sides, so you don't need to see the problem from any of it. So, any or any sides. It's yeah. about a family. So the mom gave birth to uh, two kids with this guy, and yeah, according to the story, like he was according to the thing, you know, he was not rich, but you know, she liked him, and then she just gave married, you know, like yeah. a lot of European women did. Okay. And then she gave birth, but for a better life, now she has to go outside Ethiopia and work. So the family member, it doesn't matter who, they borrow money to her, and then she just have to get out of the country. What with the kids? The kids, uh, the father's family will look after them. Wow, can a mother leave the kids? Yeah, sometimes people do that, you know. Okay. But actually we say, we say if your bad people are not materialistic, you know, we fall in love with the person who's, who understands us instead of who have money or something. Why does someone want to go to abroad? Yeah, but to get money, you know. See, it, it's paradox. Yeah, but I mean, if they're not To get money and, yeah, to get money and for a better life. Okay, yeah, that's yeah, a paradox. Yeah. Like I told yeah. you, that's a paradox. Yeah. Uh, okay. Now, if you ask me why did I come out, it's because I have to live here. You know. Of course, I didn't run away from my kids or something. Oh. But, yeah, and uh, you have to live here. And, but for, for them, it's for getting money, you know, for, for a better yeah, yeah. life, for working and for... It's fair enough, but uh, I feel it's still it's difficult for mom to live there. Okay. Yeah, but it was That's so difficult for her. Yeah. Let's say it was so yeah. difficult for her. She, she, can you talk about that woman? What's happened, so? Yeah, okay. Uh, and then, the thing is... Now the, their life story is on public, right? Yeah. So it, we have to learn something out of it. That's what I believe. Since the case is there, we have to learn something out of it. And that's also the idea of the mom, putting it on, on the video. Yeah. So, um, I feel like it's going to be only English, the program. I'm sorry, guys. Um, so the problem is the women. Now she is, she have to bring them. You know, after um, I think 16 years. No, after 15. I don't know. After 10 years. Please. Because when the daughter come here, when she leave her, she was four years old. Yeah. And how long time was she away from her the child? Yeah, they meet again when she's 14, 10 years. 10 years. Yeah, wow. but in the middle, I think she go and visit her. Something, you know, like, you know, wow. like a lot of people do. Wow. She must yeah. be really rich when she come back. Where? If she take 10 years abroad, get yeah, a lot of money. Yeah, but she gets to German, so she, has to bring, she can bring now her kids. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah. yeah, but in the meantime, she find out her husband. In the first of all, she she used to think her husband is a bad person because he used to hit her, and I think he used to also cheat on her. Something. Does that happen uh, normally in your country? A lot of time or just sometimes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter, but, anyways. But now she, she likes so to go now, to So now, let me finish the story. Yeah, yeah. Like, okay. Now she have to, uh, yeah, I have to make it like clear, you know, so that yeah. I don't have to tell the story again. Yeah. So uh, now she, the, the kids come here, you know. So there is this difference in, in between the mom and the daughter. It's like uh, they don't really connect. Of course, you can feel it. Yeah. You know, any mom who been away from her son for. I don't know more than some sometimes you know when especially when your kid is five six seven up to ten years old when when they want explanation yeah. about things about motherhood and something if you're not there that's lost but anyway she she come here right so she come here and she lived like um, I think four years until she's nineteen and then she, she has to come out to go out of the house or she stay with the mom until she's nineteen and then yeah and then she has to come to go out. Out. Yeah. And the mom have to kick her out. Oh. And the mom said, the mom, she said, she kicked her daughter out because she was not being very good in school, and she started talking with this, with the, you know, Instagram, the boys, and everything, and. Uh, she also meet her boyfriend and she start making videos, dancing videos. So the mom looked this and she said, okay, no, she don't need to bring her boyfriend home. She, you know, she's a woman and she's also a woman with 45 years old. She also wants a woman. That's what the daughter said. Anyways, for some reasons, she, have, she kick her out. It's not like she kick her out a lot. She's 19, so she go out. She yeah. to, to go out. So now they fight because 
the mom think now every money that she, the daughter makes goes to the family and she said your family are not good save yourself those people just want money and money and money but the daughter it's her father you know it doesn't matter if you have another kid send something it's her father and she feel like she has to send money for her grandparents there oh she feel the daughter feels she has to send money yeah back. because she have to come to the video and she said oh. i i want it that's what i want i want to send money and there's nothing wrong with that but the mom said these people have been taking money from me my whole life you know because they have to send me out yeah they are they want money and when i was there they're abusive verbally mentally and they abuse her so she had to come out but all the time in when she when the daughter was in addis she been hearing bad things about her mom abandoning her going there and something yeah so it's like what do you think about this situation is like which one is right and both of them come to public and say what they feel you know i feel clearly it's okay when she 19 she leave the home but yeah. um, if she had to take care of herself she had to buy uh, food and clothes and she also had to, a new uh, place to live and so she, yeah so she would really get uh, uh, need and the money she uh, she earned herself yeah. and pay for herself and if it's not have enough i guess she not have enough then still the mom have to support her but yeah. there cannot be enough money to begin to send back to family, granddad and some things. No, that's I feel is wrong. Yeah, but she's learning uh, nursing, you know. So when she learned nursing, yeah. she, uh, uh, remember she uh, she come here she, since she was 14. Yeah. And maybe she's active because in one of her yeah. videos I see she speak Germany. Yeah. And she's working and studying at the same time in a nursing house. Yeah. So she gave money. And even the daughter is scared that the mom wants to post possess this money like you know, want to control it it means she's getting yeah. money and that's the truth yeah but maybe also the mom feel she want uh, not not to be curious but really inside she want to help her to find out if she can administrate her money her yeah income. exactly that's a reason it's a kind of love yeah it's a, the, the daughter feel it's very bad she want to know her economy but it's i feel it's more for helping her yeah yeah, it's uh, and then yeah, not only that, you can re you can really see teenagers coming from Arab countries, Ethiopian, Eritrean coming here. Yeah, they just don't have feelings with money at all. They they, they never work any time in their life and no, no no time. And then when they get them when they get the money, they never get this this amount of money in Ethiopia no. or in their country. So they think this is easy money and yeah. it's you know like. What's coming easy goes easy, and yeah. uh, I'm sure the mom do it in a good way. And also my experience when I see we go to some uh, some uh, big uh, storehouse, see a lot of foreigners that come here, refugees also. Hmm? I'm yeah. surprised they buy very nice things, very expensive shoes and so. And I'm wondering because I have a thought to do it also, but I'll never do it so much as I see they're doing. Yeah. Because I'll always say no. The money is better to have them in the back. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. So we're careful, but they're not careful. So this means I cannot, uh, of course it's not the general, but it's what I, I see happen. And also I remember you told me you saw some someone, you meet a foreigners also. They're buying a lot. Yeah, and a lot. All, like, always brand marks and, and Yeah, and, and, like and, and, a guy uh, I used to things. study driving with, the funny part is, he didn't get the driving license, but he already buy a new car with all his savings. Yeah. It's like, we do, I mean, we don't even have a new car. People don't normally have a new car unless they, are, they own a little business, right? Yeah. They buy second and they buy second and yeah. it's, it's like normal. But he said, no, brand new. He wanted, he wanted. I, I admire the dream and the, the thing. I remember my, my dad here, he said to me when I was quite young, my son, the worst you can put money in is a car. As soon as you're running out from the port with the dealers, it's lose a lot in value. Yeah. And it's lose always. Yeah, right. Yeah. So it's the most bad investment you can do. Yeah. But that's right. But anyway, we talk about this later there. So I yeah. feel the mom doing well for try to look after her daughter. Yeah, but she said a lot of things. The thing is, I love my dad. And if my mom come in public, it doesn't matter how you know like 
it doesn't matter like how bad he is to my mom. Oh. It doesn't matter how bad he is to my mom. My mom should not come. She can't. She can come and say bad things about her marriage. But she cannot call him a bad father because that's Sam Ravid's decision. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she said, he didn't, one time she said, I, I have to write it. She said that to her daughter. He could not raise you because, you know, she has to send money often. He could not raise you and then he have to go and make another family and then you think he's a good dad. Mm. Will that make a person less a good dad? No, he can still be a good dad because you cannot expect that a man will go home 10 years where a wife is abroad. It's, it's not possible. Yeah, right? It's not possible. But you know, marrying and having kids and oh, sti no. still calling her and beg and tell her he love her, he, she should pick, she should take him to German. Yeah, but he I still, feel that... He still he, do this. Yeah, he can be honestly, he love her. Yeah, but right, when right. he cannot live forever solo, yeah. alone, so nothing wrong with that. Yeah, but he should not make another family. The thing is, he don't go out and just fuck a, fuck women. That's totally normal. No, but you but see, he make a family. He make another. But I, I feel it's nearly impossible to avoid in your country where you it's say impossible. the most of them will not get allowed to use uh, condoms protection. So yeah, they're allowed. Happen. I mean, not, they're not. It's not that they're not allowed. But you know, always condoms and other type of contraceptives work 95.5. It doesn't. They're not working 100%. And if that if that doesn't work, a child will be born. Yeah. Uh, a pregnancy will not be inter inter interrupted. Have you not a free abort in abortion in your country? It's not free, but there is. Uh, every day, a lot of people get an abortion in, in Ethiopia. I read in in magazine that uh, two hundred thousand around Abyss. Well, but the thing is, they have to pay for it. Yeah, like um, I try to work in uh, in Mary Stops. Like there is a company. I don't know exactly how much they pay, but they have to pay for the pill. Yeah, yeah. yeah to buying the yeah, pill yeah. and something, and then they will be forced to have. Um, what is it? Not forced, it, but you know, in, yeah, yeah. in like. To have um, yeah. whatever content, like, I feel also, because I'm a yeah. On a way, it's also okay to, to pay for it themselves because if they're not really pay tax of any income, here we yeah. pay a high tax, and this means a lot of things is for free. But it's not for free in reality, in real, because yeah. you pay so high tax. Yeah. The most pay um, about the half of the income back to the government yeah, exactly. tax. Yeah, in my country, the tax regulation is, you know, a lot of people cheat and a lot of people. Yeah. The, so, the government don't have a system to no, control so. everything. It's, it's kind of hard. But the thing is, yeah, so anyways, she has two kids. You know, it looks like she hate him. She don't really love him before. It's just, it's in Ethiopia, there is this kind of cold. The, when the guy gives you attention, especially when you are born and... Uh, when you are grown up with your grandmother, not fatherly figure around, yeah. or even if the fatherly figure around, not really, you know, not like you have to get it. You love this guy, the first guy who gave you attention. Yeah. You just love him, and you love him, and that he, you think he love you back. That's automatically you will come because he give you just attention. Yeah. Maybe you don't have any job. That's why he gave you attention, but that's true love. Yeah. <laughs> I. Yeah, it's kind of that, you know, it, there is this mis like you cannot understand it really. But, if you have two kids and she have to get out and... Uh, but they get out to Germany, both of them? Both, she get both the kids out. Wow. You see, it's also bad for the father. Now he, he lose them, they go to Germany. Yeah, it's and always, he cannot it should not be fair. No, yeah. Not, not now they have to grow up without a father. Yeah. And then, the first thing, the first guy, uh, Samri meet, he will be perfect for her. Yeah. It doesn't matter how what kind of personality really he has. Just because he's the first person who gives her attention, yeah. that's perfect. Yeah. And that's true but, love. And Ethiopian guys are yeah. like, oh, yeah. That's also funny to, to think about it. Uh, mostly kids, especially girls, women, when they grow up, they find. Uh, find someone looks like the father at home yeah that's quite normal because they look up to him and they feel safe with that yeah 
here we say there's a lot of uh, a lot of uh, people also that have a problem with alcohol here in the country. And sometimes the daughter say, "I've never find an alcoholist," but she do, she do because that's the way she grew up and feel like yeah. home. Yeah, so she will not go yeah. out to some other system. They also yeah. be more nervous. Yeah, so you send it up, she find one that is like like yeah. she uh, know uh, from home. Yeah, and it's always like you know, like mother, like daughter. Yeah. She this woman she copy what her mother wants mostly. Yeah. And then also this the story I'm talking about the woman, she said, she said the funny thing is she's just like me. She said that, which means you have to make you have to be sure that she's going to find a man just like your your husband or her dad. Yeah. Yeah, and you have to. It's like you don't need to push. You don't need to push your daughter away. Like you know, that's what what when then when we need you know as a 19 year old, that was when I need my mom. To just guide me through, especially if my mom or if her is in uh, Europe, she thinks she's liberal. She thinks, you know, now my daughter is 19, she should get out, have a boyfriend, rent her house. That's her job. That's her freedom. She give her freedom. Yeah. She, you know, that's that. Salute for that. But she need her emotionally. She need this strong woman. You're not a public figure. You're also a mother, right? So she need this woman guiding her through. So, so, not life for the, been, so that she will not be that's a hard for the life. daughter five years is hmm? yeah to different culture different everything now i i come here when i was 23. Mm -hmm. now she come here when she was 15. i can really you know understand what kind of change she yeah. is going through because yeah but it's good because she would be more more european mindset than uh, african mindset mm -hmm. it's not that it's bad but she's living in europe so she will just adapt it yeah maybe yeah, also i am ethiopian mindset maybe I'm also she'll miss the home country but, because yeah. uh, uh, when you come to german she have to understand she has to work hard yeah. and she have to get a good income if else she will have a bad life yeah. And also, everyone around her has paid she will work hard. Yeah, right? Yeah. Maybe not physical, but then she have to get a bigger yeah. education and get high income. Yeah. Um, it can still be like outside. Yeah, so, than that, yeah. no one says better. Maybe the better in your country where. Yeah, yeah, life is very much, very much better in Ethiopia, you know. Maybe you will not find something like you cannot make this kind of cake home. You cannot have fancy things because not because you don't have money. It's because they never happen to be important. No. We never happen to think about them to bring them to us. We're just what we have is just enough, and that's enough. And I then guess. when you learn in Europe, when you've been in Europe and go back, it's kind of hard. But that they, you get a lot of. Because here you people. can get everything and so just just get it. Yeah. Find it few minutes time is money <coughs> I remember when I should buy a little tools with with, with your city how we should run around yeah. to find a little bit here and a little bit there therefore of course it's difficult to, to build some things up because it's complicated it is complicated yeah and one problem is people don't learn learn you know for example like in my house nobody I know I don't know nobody I know can uh, can cut a wood measure and you know handworks like you do here yeah. like our neighbor the woman even she can do it yeah. she have tools and but she I'm, can I'm, take that's something they learn growing I'm, up but for us we call we call for someone yeah. to come or we go and ask them and i believe it really i think everyone can do it the difference is that you in, in china style it will be very bad quality they'll yeah. do it uh, not properly enough that's the problem because it has to be People not accept this is the right angle. It yeah, has to be right? perfect. Yeah. But I'm sure they can but do quality everything. Have a can price. Do. Yeah. Yeah, but sometimes maybe we we don't need quality. That's also, you know, maybe we want quantity. Yeah. That's that's yeah, also yeah. one preference, yeah. right? So we cannot say it's some this things one are better is not, than other things. This no. is different and that, that's also what Yeah, okay, if you're watching sense. my live, please, I'm having a conversation. Yeah. And now um, the, uh, and one time she said, uh, the mom, she said, she also loved her, her father, but he was not a perfect 
husband to her mom, which is exactly the same situation, right? It's like sometimes I can see my life and my mom's life the, being the same, and I can feel my daughter's life being kind of the same because it's genetic. Yeah, it is. And then the mom grew up with grandmothers the same way like her daughter. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and yeah. uh, she said her father was not perfect to, to her mom, but she still loved him. But now she's trying to take that love away from her daughter, which is wrong, right? Yeah. Also, Samri have the right to love her father despite whatever, whatever kind of man he is. Maybe he can be a monster, mm. right? She have the right to love her father. Yeah, I feel... I feel everyone should love their mom and dad. Yeah. Uh, that's a general rule. It doesn't matter how bad they can be, you should still love your mom and dad. Yeah, but not when they are bad to you. That no, I disagree but, um, with. Uh -uh. No, no, I feel still. <laughs> you come no way with, uh, with big arguments and fightings and something. Yeah, but if I did something to my daughter, she should have the right to hate me. If I have the right or the mind to do something, to do something that is against her. Yeah, I am okay, but I, I, don't, I don't agree. <laughs> no. A lot of Ethiopian people also think, despite whatever the mom is doing, mom is mom. Mom. Mom is mom. You know, you cannot yeah. hate your mom. A lot of people cannot, you know, they, they have to come to my personal messenger and they try to tell me what moms are, you know, doing, it doesn't yeah, matter. You remember always when, when girls or also boys, when they're about teenager, I feel the mom and dad is crazy. Yeah. They hate them. They're willing to leave them. They have not afford to leave them, but they're but willing they will, to do. Yeah? They're so They're even willing the to kill dad. themselves sometimes. Yeah, yeah, they will yeah. say, I kill myself, I hate life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but, but after yeah. some years when they're all this time, and they begin to get a girlfriend and have to present her home with mom and dad, then he t tell her girlfriend how nice mom and dad is. Yeah. And he begin to change and after a while he, he feel that the best in the world. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that I, I'm sure, you know, that I was also a teenager. I was angry with my moms and I'm, I'm some, at some point I'm still angry at some point. But the thing is, I have, when I have a baby, when I was pregnant, it was too much. It was too much that I have to cry in front of my own mom and try to say, now I'm being irritated about how I grow up and thinking through, you know, yeah, thinking the detail. That, yeah, was, I was disturbed. Yeah. Yeah, I was disturbed. It's like, I feel like every mother in Ethiopia, they're wrong because what I have to to, to go through because because I'm pregnant, yeah. I don't think any Ethiopian women go through that. <laughs> And then I was like, try emotionally as a child, what I've been going through and something. And my mom, she punished me. Oh, she, she just, you know, like, um, she squeezed me. So I have to be mad at her and something. So she was here, like, right? They were here when I gave birth. And my dad was standing right in front of me when Lucy came out. That's like weird. But anyways. You were very close to your father. Yeah, I mean, I'm my daddy's daughter. That's yeah, yeah, that's cool. Like you know, I like the guys who have. But that's also also fantastic with children here. See, a little uh, child to be born, they come from the commune and check. Yeah. Immediately yeah. after a while, after a while, they call it to the doctor to check. The they call us to some special checked. clinic to show and tell them how we bruise the teeth yeah. on a little baby. Yeah. yeah. That's, By the way. And you have to do it. If not. You yeah, if not, do you remember? The, the book. When Lucy was four months, the Yonema, she had to come here. Yeah. And then I was like, okay, now I did everything, I do everything. You know, they check like, the home also. Yeah, you know, normally it's 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 not too very clean and very tidy house, but it's friendly, it's home. Yeah. It's where I feel like it's home. A lot of Danish houses, they look like a museum. I feel like the people be careful when they sit in their own sofa so that they don't miss anything. But me, it's my home and I like it. And my bag, my bag is there. Maybe sometimes my books are there, and I like it. But it's not messy but because see, it's always open. See, you saw this uh, movie yesterday from Ungarn, where someone, the the, the, the Romanian, they live twelve or fourteen uh, yeah. people in a little room. In one and room. The, the, the roof is coming water in, and they have no yeah, electricity or nothing. See. Here, you have to have minimum. 20 square meters per person. person yeah? This means when we got a little Lucy, there need to be extra 20 square meters. Yeah, they w I don't know. We will move on? Huh? What would we do? 
Yeah. And we have it. This is oh, yeah, our, this is, this is, yeah, our, this is our, our second, this is our second house. Yeah. This is just <laughs> I forgot. A vacation house. Okay, anyways, so they have to come and check, right? And then I didn't have a toothbrush because she didn't have a tooth. We just she just she didn't have a tooth, did she? No, no but no, uh, uh, maybe one or two. One one tooth, but we should still Yeah, two. And then she said, Where is her toothbrush? And I'm like, Us? Ours or what? No, the babies. And, and then I said Oh, Peter said we have to wait until the the first teas are out. The yeah. milk teas yeah, are out. Yeah, the next yeah. next yeah. <laughs> and then you said also something bad. Yeah. Maybe it was a mistake, but that's what I heard. As you say, uh, in the school, they teach you not to brush your teeth too much because the teeth uh, cream will take the, the ceramic or whatever, that will damage your teeth. <laughs> and uh, when we tell that to dentists here, they laugh. <laughs> yeah, but the thing Never is, nobody teach so me, listen, before. nobody teach me, but when I was grade four, there is this woman, if you are ever watching this video, please text me, called Magda, and she said she have a grandmother like who's, who live in France, or something about France, and she can also say some France word, so we, we're like, we're, she's like the queen of the class, so she said one time, my grandmother, she said, don't brush your teeth very too much, and uh, the whole day, because there are glasses, glasses on top of your teeth, and you'll break them. <laughs> that just stuck in my head forever. <laughs> and then I think true. it's true because no. I still keep my white teeth because I'm careful when I brush them. I just take off the dirt and I don't do it like, for example, like you three times a day. Yeah, I do it the minimum three times a day. Yeah, but I, I don't. Bad I, do, I, I do it maybe when I, well, not when I sleep. Yeah, when I sleep sometimes and when I wake up yeah. sometimes. Yeah, but, but I do it once in a day. But funny, but little Lucy, they have one teeth, and this the lady, she teeth. want to know which cream we're buying, yeah. because they have this and this, need to have this and this, this uh, uh, stuff cream. inside yeah. the creams, exact. And that yeah. was so important. That yeah, funny. and the last time also yeah. she had to tell me that I have to put this hand and this hand, uh -huh. hold her, it doesn't matter if she just, you know, what is it? Yeah, yeah. But the far I got them, it doesn't matter. Uh -huh. And the rest of the teeth. Yeah. You have to hold it. And I'm like, okay. But it's a nice trick because you can just no with this one. You just put it like this. Maybe I should do it you. Oh <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <I don't know. laughs> no. But it's fantastic. nice you can the uh, dominant I'm tagging to all the All all you from your lovely country have so white teeth. Yes, because we don't brush them. Only <laughs> oh, no 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 no. We no. brush them with no, no. natural teeth. So it's only white or black. For when we go to uh, um, yeah, the, the, the Havasa. Oh, the Havasa. They're nearly just, black. Yeah. So, I yeah. mean, that's funny. Yeah, but Havasa, they have special teas. It's not that they don't brush it or not. It's from the water. The chloride. Calorie? Wow. No, chloride. The know. chloride makes effect. Mm. Like kalk. Kalk. Yeah. They have a lot of kalk in the water. It's good. Bruises and citron. Thank you, sir. Like um, used to the coffee machine. <laughs> yeah, they should have. That's a joke. Yeah, but a lot of people get a new teeth. But you know, that's that's. You can see they are from that area by the by their teeth. Yeah. The funny part is okay. it's because they have I the like water has salt. It's okay. Yeah, okay. Pack. Of course, Peter. Your God. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, and then yeah, I mean. Uh, yeah, and guess what the daughter said. Yeah. What? In in live video. Uh, not in life, but you know, in the video. Yeah. And she told to, to her mom the funny, like five or six six points. When she said, yeah. "You believe, you believe in uh, in money." <laughs> the daughter said to mom. Yeah. Yeah. You believe in money, but that's also what people tell me when I'm when you are being careful with your money. When you know where to invest them, you're also greedy. You will be called greedy. Yeah, but you know, uh, people feel feel it's so easy to get money here. It's not so easy if you not uh, work or yeah. have a good education or not be refugee and save money. And if you're refugee, so you can get money. Yeah, that get it more easy. Yeah, because they didn't need to think about to get a job. They'll get it anyway. Yeah. But else. And also, so important, as we talked about before, some spend the money immediately when they, they get the salary into the account. Yeah. That's 
Yeah, and they, you know, it's, 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 it's good paid. Normally per hour. Yeah, yeah. You get paid good, good money. Yeah. But it's never used as much as you earn. It's always just used maybe. Half? The best is, uh, the half is a lot. A lot uh, to use? No, 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 no. Okay, sorry. I mean, yeah, you, you, should save, like... you should save a quarter or something, 25%. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And save it. Keep it in the bank. Yeah, exactly. Stay. That's the smart way, you know. You, you and invest if in you some can, things. just use half of it. Yeah. If you can. And invest the other things in some things. Yeah. Because here you not get any interest. Here yeah. in your country they get interest. Here you in the bank. Get, yeah. And the bank uh, sector discuss now if it's uh, fair, uh, they have the customer to pay for the new yeah, after money. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah. Because they will not give anything. They want money for it. For it, money to look after your money. Yeah. Yeah. But if you use all your money and you go to the bank for borrow money, then you pay a lot. Yeah. But then if you have money in the bank, you get nothing. Yeah. Interesting. In my country, yeah, but the inflation is going down. Uh, and, yeah. Denmark is nearly no inflation. Yeah, no. that's why that's why also you don't need that's to pay money no. to put your money in the bank. Yeah. And here in Denmark, the government knows how much money I get, he gets, everybody gets. They know everything. They know everything. How much money is in my credit card when uh, I buy some uh, some tomatoes and something with my credit card, when I take money out of the vending machine. Uh, they, it's just, it, the, I put my print everywhere. People are working. And your mobile pay, your number, your phone call, everything, you're under a watch. Yeah, and the most of let them pay automatic from the bank. You put in a system so they take the money direct. Yeah. And then uh, you need, not need to think about to tell the tax government how much you earn. And so if you're employed, yeah. everything is automatic. Yeah, it's, they know it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so it's also like in Ethiopia, we have more freedom. Yeah. We can. Um, you know, we have more freedom. If you if you have another kid somewhere, you can help them without knowing anything. Yeah. But here, the one one story from Peter's story, like I tell them about event story. So so you uh, all know. Should I say it in English? No, I should say it in Amharic. Yeah, okay. So you don't get girlfriend yaza. Girlfriend yaza na ya o kazi malad sa ganyas masasale na ma ma yazub chasa ni garma chuna garma nahi. How do you get a new one? You can get a new one. 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 You and then uh, you just get later send something and but in Ethiopia if you have a, if you have a child you can just hide him forever you just no, don't need to give money to the mom yeah and also I, I had to hear one case about the women uh, she had to go to Arab countries and she didn't see her child for 15 years. She never saw her since she was 11 months. She never saw her. And then now she said before three years, when she go to visit her, he told the husband told her, oh, he gave it. He gave her to adoption to Switzerland family. That's impossible here. Yeah, but he already did. And she, have, she sent me all the pictures and something. She want me to find the woman, you know. She, she found the, wow. the daughter dead. The good part is she said she would like to explain the daughter what, what she's been going through. I feel it's bad for the daughter. The daughter may, maybe never will forgive the mom. And she left her to be away in 15 years. It's not fair. Yeah. Okay, she have her reason to do it. Yeah. But then she also have to accept that the daughter will have very, very difficult to forgive her. Yeah, but if she never meet her, it would have been easy. No, it's worse. Okay. She'll I, always I think a mother that have born a child will never forget this child. Yeah, if they get it away with, with uh, to someone else, and she feel it's okay after some years, after some time, she will be always have in mind what she doing the little daughter or the little son or whatever. I think yeah. they will always feel her yeah. feeling. Unless maybe, I, I, I don't know if, if they maybe have 10 you know. children. 
could have a lot of children, maybe they, they, they just them. get them because they're not controlled themselves, but they're not allowed to use. Contraceptive and yeah. abortion, yeah. That's maybe a, give another feeling. Yeah. And the children just coming from yeah. themselves. Yeah. yeah. But one thing I learned from the story we were talking about is the daughter clearly, she said, me and you don't know each other. No. It means, yeah, so from this story, what we learn, what I learn is do whatever you want not to be away from your child within the first 10 years, right? Minimum the first 10 years. If you have to bring a child to the world, try everything not to be away. And then you can be away after that. Yeah. It's yeah, more like agree. understandable. Yeah. If you are 10 years old and if your mom have to work somewhere, it's more like you'll be proud. You tell your dog, your your friends, oh, my mom is in America, she's working and she's getting money, exactly. and I'll go soon, and it's going it's going to make a plus to you. But if you're a, a child, that's like an empty, you cannot feel them. But you know, the first one or two or three years, they'll be connected to the family and feel if they get love enough, and that's so important because then they get a higher self confidence. Yes. They feel they've been loved. Yeah. And this will follow the whole life. Exactly, that's inside. also what I live, yeah? If they're being left, they have a bad feeling of that. They come on a children's uh, home, they take care of them, maybe not have a good life. Yeah. Like we saw it from Ungarn. And also if you, if mom and dad have a lot of yeah. agreement, discussion, so fight. Uh, the whole life, they will always have some, they will not feel good enough compared to the other people. Yeah. That's a shame. I believe it's true. This this this, uh, this would be uh, made in them in the first years, two three years. Yeah. yeah. But also in in old days, uh, they send often children when they are 10, 12 years to school in another country and something. Yeah. To England and so. wherever. Yeah. yeah. Because yeah, then they are like all the time. Yeah. I feel like after ten years, you can do whatever you want. Your child can understand understand everything he knows exactly who you are what you mean to him mm -hmm. he will have this stand and he will think you're taking a long vacation mm -hmm. and he will miss you write you or something that's also I, maybe the child also needed the child needs some you know teenager a long time you're not going to be on his neck one one good thing is as we talked about before when they be 12 13 14 they begin to hate the mom and dad yeah if they come for some to this kind of uh, school, where they look after them and they give them a good education, and then they're not come in this situation, in this age, where they can hate the mom and dad, because as soon as they're away from them, then they'll love mom and dad. Yeah, they will, yeah exactly. Instead That's of, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I think so. But one, one thing that makes me laugh is her daughter, it's like she's kind of religious, you know, in a childish way, you know, when when I was a religious person, you know, God knows everything, God gives everything, and God is like, a, he will put me somewhere, mom, why are you jealous? Yeah. But you know, she's kind of too emotional, uh, religious, so she said, if my husband, if my dad was a bad guy, God will not give him another wife and another kiss. Yeah, also that. <laughs> yeah, it's kind you of can, cute, but yeah. childish, you know. You don't need to be a nice yeah. dad for you have another kid. Do you? No. God doesn't need to love you, you just have to go out yeah. and find a woman and have sexual relations with her. And most probably she will be pregnant. But this and then that's how you get a ba another sister for some reason. Yeah. But how is the daughter that be pushed away from the mom? The mom looks after the money. Maybe also the daughter uh, feels she look after her private life. Because she may be scared of her she be pregnant as soon as she meets her. Uh, once she feels in love. The daughter? Yeah, it could be also. Yeah, I mean, she should tell her because um, I think the mom get pregnant when she was very young because she would grow up with grandmother, yeah. grandfather, not really someone close to her, yeah. telling her about sexuality and she something. She should tell her, really. So, yeah, she also, herself, she says, when her friends find decent man, yeah. because she wants me, she's missing all the attention, she go to this guy who who's a nearly a beggar and a sore yeah. at the yeah. same time. Yeah. That's her words. <laughs> yeah. So if you not love my I swear. And not, uh, it's much yeah. better so, so, so also so 
the girl to trust the mom because they can talk about it like two adult women yeah. together. Because I'm the gonna... mom cannot begin to control her and say, you're not allowed to go out with boys and something. No, she didn't say that. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. But in one of the videos I heard, like, I didn't hear the whole point, but I heard she's controlling the... She also have a son. He's not in this fight story, but he, there is also a son in the in the in the book in the life. Yeah. And she was like, "Oh, my house is not a club. It's not a hotel. <laughs> you cannot come and sleep whenever you are drinking. Yeah. Boy, get out! I'm not yeah, going yeah. to open the door." Like exactly, my mom used to say when I was like late after having dinner with my friends. You know, that's typical Ethiopian. And Nancy, like you become like typical Ethiopian. I cannot believe, GJ. Maybe anyway. you should say something to uh, mic sometimes. I think four people. There, there was like from seven to four people, and I think they're staying here because they can understand my English. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, but Maria and Dana got to my hotel back in Benghazi. Good night. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I like to have this conversation with you. That's why so they can hear her. Okay. Yeah, and uh, yeah, I think I'm nice to sit and talk. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Gigi, the mom, she said one thing. Yeah, and then Gigi, the thing I, I don't understand, I don't like is this part, you know, when she have to be like typical mothers on her son. They're worse. Mothers are worse when they have a boy. Why? <laughs> I don't know, it looks like they love him too much, you don't want him to go out. I don't They're know. worse. Huh? I didn't believe it. Mm -hmm, they are worse. Huh? You don't go you out and... That? Yeah, oh, you're on the Goran side. I'm sure it's yeah, the opposite. Side. I don't know, it's like... It's like if, if, like... Uh, if they never grow together... Yeah. If they, if she didn't, if she didn't create this bond, like Kasamri gay, yeah, yeah, never have a bond, she would not bring it to the brother because it's like the same. He, she been away from him also. So now he comes to Germany. He meet this, you know, a lot of Arab foreigners and a lot of foreigner friends. So he have to go out and you know, like enjoy life. Maybe have sex with German women. Yeah, yeah, of course. And drink the whole night like German teenagers, like yeah, yeah. in his age, he's twenty something, right? Yeah. Of course. But now, mom, she said, she just said, oh, don't, don't get up and open the door for him. Who are you to open the door for him? Let right. him sleep in the hotel. Really? Yeah, she said that. But the thing is, now I think she have to pay eight hundred fifty times three thousand euro, three thousand and something, and she rent him a house. Good. You have to go out and rent a house. And you also have to study. Yeah. Now she ran, he's out of the house. Mm. And then the daughter, she said, she kick all of us out. And she used to have a, a husband also. She kick him out. Just because she likes to make live videos 24 hours. And so that she can bring a man to the house. <laughs> <laughs> I like this drama. <laughs> so I can do anything. I'm allowed to do anything because I'm a child. So some is yeah. also allowed to do anything because she's a child. She can come to the video and she can say bad things about her mom. Mom should not be angry, okay? She said, oh, don't ever say you have a mom. Don't ever come back. And your boyfriend, he will leave you. Something like that. <laughs> you say that. <laughs> of course the boyfriend will leave her. Nobody marry their boyfriend when they are, oh, except you. By the way, Peter here, Yeah. he marry his first girlfriend. Yeah. Is she your first? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah, he married his first girlfriend since she, they were like 17 or something. Not the first girlfriend. Okay. But very young. Yeah, like you were. You yeah, we, we, uh, we met each other when she was uh, 17. And you? Uh, no, 16. I was 17. Yeah. I'm, I'm I remember, one different. I remember I bought my uh, dad's car <laughs> and we come to a dancing place where I met my first wife. <laughs> and then uh, <laughs> it's funny when I ask her that. if I should drive her home. Yeah, yeah. To get with your friends. Yeah, okay. So I drive her home. Oh, fine. So um, we begin to see it sort of. So I forgot this with my age and some things. Because after some months I said to her, Oh, we should celebrate my 18 years birthday next month. Mm -hmm. Well, next week. Yeah. She said, you are 18. No. <laughs> you have driver license. No. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, because of the driving license, right? Yeah. yeah. You're supposed to be eight, yeah, more yeah, than so 18. Yeah, yeah, so your shooter is 18. Yeah. And then maybe she don't want to, maybe only one year older yeah, yeah. boy. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, but anyways, they've been married and were they, his first kid. Yeah, yeah, when she was 18. When she was 18, imagine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's kind of crazy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's kind of special. You don't find another Danish couples who have child when they are 18. <laughs> I think he's kind of special, like me. Yeah, you were special, right? I don't know, baby, you were special. <laughs> <laughs> you were special, baby. Yeah. <laughs> it's a shame if they so, don't understand. But I think they understand it, or they can, you know, use a dictionary, ah, pause it, and too, say too, too much work. <laughs> yeah, but I'm, they, they, I'm sure. I mean, like they can learn English without conversation. It's not so hard. English we use. Okay. Are you think right? No, no. I wish I had some people try to listen to me because they like me, That's because the they love me, and then learn <laughs> English in the way. Learn what I think and understand me on the way. I didn't need to speak London English. Oh no, please. I'm having. <laughs> <laughs> you got a tea party? <laughs> yeah, can we have some tea? <laughs> I, I really like to have some tea, please. Oh, maybe when I finish with my coffee. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. So, uh. So, where we yeah, come wait, from? the thing is, yeah, the thing is. So she, uh, she said, but she said like kind of negative things about her daughter. Not bad things, but that she don't like need to love her father. Like nearly she hate your dad. That's the message she she's giving her. Hate your dad. Love me because I I bring you here. Oh, one time she said, can you not count this as a favor that I bring you here? Aye. <laughs> It's like this is a mind abuse that much. typical mothers are uh, play it's too with. Much. She just bring her. Maybe she sh she would get money out of them. We don't know, right? <laughs> like a lot of uh, mom he moms here, they bring their daughter because they will get a no. bigger house. Oh, listen. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know my Come people, on. please. <laughs> so they get a bigger house, and not not only Ethiopian people or a lot of people and any people. If you are also in German, and if you would like to live in Denmark. When you bring your daughter here, of course you get automatically a big house, right? Yeah. Especially if you are a refugee, foreigner, asylum seeker. Yeah. The government will cover you. Oh, well, things. they'll find out. Yeah, they'll room. find out. And uh, the character I'm trying to tell you, she's an activist. So maybe she said she cannot go back to her country. And then she have a citizenship because I think maybe she asked like as the Ethiopian government is wanting I, I that i would like somebody to give me a clarification no, she cannot i be think she get married if to come, Deni, to if they come from ethiopia they cannot be refugees but if, she, if the government is going to kill you you can seek asylum like iraq the woman in iraq she's not a refugee but she's a asylum seeker because uh if i go back to my country uh, my life is in danger because i'm supporting this political party Oh, yeah. 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 I'm not covering my summer in the last few days. I'm not doing my hair. I'm not like I mean, why any other time? So I'm not like I I don't put energy to hate. But if I don't agree, like has some way like I make a line, has some way I have to make a clear line. I'm not doing this. I have to make a clear line. So she got a better life here. Yeah. If I'm here, like a refugee. If I have another daughter, will it not be better life for me? A little bit. It is. Yeah, it's a little bit better because one, I have a daughter. The country, the government will not kick me out easily. Like I don't have a daughter. Oh. Uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't. No. Okay. I kick you out if you're not. If there be peace in your home country, they will do everything to kick you out again. Yeah. Unless you show and you go into the community here and learn the language and get a job and can earn all your money yourself. That's also fair. Yeah. Yeah. So who is yeah. the government? 
it's all of us. Yeah, true. true. So in my country, the government is own, own other own money. monster that we can't see and eat some people on the behalf and kill. It's just another six, six, six monster. Yeah. We don't know what, who is this government that is, he's, uh, he's bad and but, like a monster. But this, uh, this mom in German, they want her daughter to come. Uh, that's also not a reason for her. She say, oh, no, I brought you here. It should yeah. be a big gift, but I'm sure she also do it for her own feeling because she know she hopefully will be old one day. Yeah. Then they're scared to be lonely. Yeah. It'll be better she know I have a daughter here. Then the daughter will always feel for mom and dad yeah. if she's fair. And yeah. then she will look after the mom. And that is like a, an insurance yeah. for the mom. Yeah. Besides, besides, you don't have to count it as a favor to bring your own daughter to where you are where she has she's supposed to be in the first place right yeah she's supposed to be with mom in the first place you don't need to say i did this for you <laughs> no <laughs> but the thing is besides why not she bring her unless she hates her daughter that's automatically normal i wish i bring a lot of people to denmark of course i want my dad here somewhere here in, in this village not also in Copenhagen, you know, I, I wish I can bring him somewhere here. I wish I can bring my mom here, my, my sisters here, my brother in North Sambi, my uh, kiddie not, in, uh, in uh, Vibo. Of course I like it. No, yeah, but I will do it and I will not count it as a favor least, because that's no, also make me feel for, good you and feel I don't good hate them and I have and the I'm chance sure to bring them. I'm sure they not feel good for but they have all the relationship and the friends at home. Yeah, yeah, no, and it but takes time to get friendship again, build it up. Yeah, yeah, no, my, uh, so it's, it's, I have it, like a happy. very crazy family with... member. Yeah. I mean, like uh, my sister, you can come here anytime and she don't even re respond to me. It's like that she don't want to come in Denmark, not enough, but she don't even, you know, I think she's a lot of people who have a message. And my friend, nearly all of them, I, not nearly, but I, some of them, I said, as much as you save your flight ticket, everything will be resp sponsored. And if I see you save 8,000 Ethiopian birds and come here, I'll pay, I'll refund the money you were going to go back. Yeah. So you only have to save 8,000. Just save them, ask them from somebody. Doesn't matter. But they're not enthusiastic and then they have life and love and I family like, okay. and everything there but i say that to them okay. yeah but nobody ever did it why because uh, they have life there they have family there and, and you cannot get a one-way ticket for eight thousand beer two ways for sixteen thousand no yes for four thousand yeah last time my she paid three thousand five hundred Okay. And then wow. even it was in New Year she left. Mm -hmm. Remember? In New Year. But it was with the flight with the bad motors. <laughs> that steering system. Oh, we should not joke. Like should the marsh doesn't work. Uh, we should not joke. Oh, yeah, we should not joke. Sorry. Yeah. No, no, I mean... It was bad. Earlier I come to this, um, to, uh, to my other group, to the group, and then uh, I make video and I was dancing and people are like, you don't need to dance. And the thing is, of course, people die. People die in the world. It's eight Ethiopian people are dying. But before three weeks, I heard th 33 Ethiopian people die in one region, all the way through. And then now, why would I, f I have this sad face for more than one day? Last time we had an, a, a sad day. The news were all over the TV, right? Mm -hmm. We have, we feel sad and it's sad and you think about your country also, oh, Ethiopian's name is on the line, you know, like Ethiopian Airlines crashed, it will be in history. Yeah. And people died and it's sad. But I don't need to suck my happiness away from my life and nothing and not make joke about airplanes, oh, wow. I can. Oh. Yeah, but people it's are really like, bad. you know, they want something uh, to point finger at. Of course I'm sad that they die. I don't want anybody to die. I don't want anybody to, no. to be sad even. But yeah, they died and yeah. We're sorry and we move on. Yeah. Yeah. So now we make a plain joke? That's allowed. It's no, been... no, no, no. I don't agree that said it. Because yeah. it was bad. This bad act is what's happened. 
made us feel sorry for all this. Yeah, but I see a, a, a YouTube video that they make. They try to make it look like it's a kidnap. It's kidnapped, and the 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 guy is pushed to get, to take it back. It's, yeah, I know, it's in Amharic. And I was like, oh my god, people. I do I believe that. They say the new type of lights that they have the sensors. If the speed be too low, then they turn the nose of the flight down automatic yeah. without the pilots for getting more speed. Mm -hmm. Because if you speed it too low, the speed, you know, we have two flight captains in the family. Yeah. That yeah, tell yeah. me also, if it be too low, then they fall direct down like a stone. Yeah. They cannot change it. Yeah, Afterwards, so they, they just fall direct down immediately like a stone yeah. if the speed is too low. So they build in the sensors. This should be a good thing. Yeah, if but, you are high. Yeah. But they think maybe there was a mistake for they did it when they were on the way up. Yes. They were not high enough. Then yeah. they turned the throat down. Yeah. That's what they write about uh, what I heard in the, in the news. Yeah. In theory. Yeah, in theory that in theory, is it. But people try to manipulate it, you know. Yeah. And America, she don't want to lose the Boeing. The Boeing. So she said she she didn't ban them. A lot of Norwegian Air and in Denmark, this Boeing. Uh, they use it this point. Yeah, but they, they 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 cancel it. Yeah, yeah, it's for making pressure on Boeing to find out what is the real problem. Yeah, but they and said they they don't have any problem and disturb the, the planes, which put it to a bad airlines on the stock. You know, it's not safe then. You know, of course we are a poor country. It's yeah, uh, America have... will just crush us. You know. I that. know. Uh -uh. Oh, they found the two black boxes. So hopefully, they will find an answer there of what's happened. Yeah. Hopefully, that they find out. Yeah. Yeah. In my country, the women are, are, are very nice, sad Ethiopian women. She, uh, not sad, but they're very nice Ethiopian women. She, she asked that they find these two black boxes. Yeah, uh -huh. And then she Long said, Yeah, and the guy explained to her that it cannot burn and it cannot drown. No, no. She said, So why don't they make the airplane with black boxes? Uh, it'll be too heavy. <laughs> I made of some special stuff. I cannot make the whole flight. So no. Yeah, it's a <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yeah, so I just nice. uh, finished okay. um, my gossip and everything. Okay. Yeah, you can nice. leave. Yeah, you can leave. Yeah. Thank you. No, I would like to. Yeah. Thank you. Good Family night. kiss. Okay. Between, Enjoy. Okay. Enjoy your time. Yeah. Bye bye, friend. Yeah. Thank you for you for 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 talking with us and for like abroad to scoundrels. Oh, would you like to join in our conversation? What? Mm. what did you say? No, he would like to join in our conversation. But okay, request to like the thing. Now, Rahana. Yeah? No, no, you can uh, do what you want. Yeah, you yeah? Call me if you want. Okay, babe. So, this uh, big cake tomorrow, I have a friend to visit, you know. So, um. Uh, so, now you should like Arabisham. You can taste it, huh? Can taste it actually. They look at you, please, please, please. Suruna, come as with. Okay. So let's see how it is. Are you ready? Actually, na. Arusana. Yes. He ne no masuwa. Lal jijim samrim. Tukrani talo. Ya gan kaze tamar kutna gabinor. Ni on lal jay. Mena manet masuwa na kafiye bihon. Aska adga manet person at this dress. Let us share the nobiye. Yeni yeso na yeni muro ala pelashin na lana.